Go for a new game. We're going to start in the Rocky Desert. We're going to call it. And we're going to call it. What do we need? We need a good game. A good game name. An even sort of that. Um. A new beginning. And, oh, I'm going to speed up here, actually. A new beginning. Well, we're not going to skip the intro. And what I'm going to try and do is um, shut up when Edit's talking. Do my best. All right. Let's go. Keep on voting, no. That's going to be said, no. Single player. Let's go. And we'll shut up um, Spotify for a few minutes. Just so we can hear everything in its all its detail. All right, take me away as well for a second. There we go. Oh, well, the cover doesn't go away, so you might as well leave me there. <laughs> Let's hope it doesn't crash. Bop. Separation from main transport complete. Group A delivered to Calistian region. All pioneers functional, initiating dispersion. Attention pioneer, I am Ada, your personal instance of the artificial directory and assistant. Welcome to the Fixit Incorporated Save the Day program. A Fixit pioneer has three core assignments. Construct. All pioneers must follow Fixit guidelines and instructions when constructing any building. Automate. Every pioneer is responsible for setting up and managing efficient pipelines, outposts, and power infrastructure. Explore and exploit. Fix-it selected planets are rich with resources suitable for direct use or further investigation. Stay within your designated. And that is why the world is counting on pioneers like you. Fix-it. Short-term solutions to long-term problems. <laughs> Okay, that's a bit different. Planet fall. Atmospheric entry in three, two, one. Beginning arrow assist. Drag within acceptable parameters. nominal Omni situational exploration suit nominal pioneer acceptable congratulations you are the third in your region to survive planet fall welcome to massage 2 a b b in the binary system of akicha All right. Objective based introduction. Begin onboarding. First contact safety tool supplied due to presence of alien megafauna. Adhere to fix it procedure and equip the fix it ink Xeno Zapper before leaving the drop zone. Next objective dismantle the drop pod. Fix it incorporated as cost effective and efficient. We do not waste. The drop pod will be recycled to construct the first stage of the habitat and utility base, often referred to as the hub. Next objective. Use the resource scanner to find and collect additional iron to be able to build the hub. If you cannot find iron, be assured scans of the planet have revealed sufficient iron sources.
Potential edible collected. Eating it and surviving does not count as a valid field test and does not generate enough data for fix it to make an informed decision. Store this potential resource for interrupting previous message for higher priority message. Next objective, use the build gun to construct the hub. Iron is a base component necessary for all near future progress, so ensure you build the hub close to iron sources. Fix it does not pay by the kilometer. Okay, we'll see. Nice to see you, mate. You feel free to lurk as much as you want, buddy. There we go, like, uh, which way, where's the biomass doing? It's going to be on the side, isn't it? So we'll go like this. There we go. All right. So we're going to... Hub foundation built. The hub terminal and crafting bench are only the humble beginnings of a successful fix-it pioneer, but essential for the next steps of onboarding. Once finished, the hub will function as your base of operations. Next objective, complete hub upgrade one. Just so you know, I'm going to be quiet while she's talking here. Yeah? I'm trying to catch all the all the other um, comments as we go along. But yeah, look, look away, mate. Glad to have you here. Uh, it took a little while to get going, clearly. A um, few issues with the download, but I think it's been fixed now. So if you if you do an update later on this evening, you'll be fine. Yep, yeah, so we're back exactly where I was the other day with my uh, with my test run through. We're going to see how far we can get uh, in the next three or four hours. All right, what do we need to do? We need oh, here we go. Oh, this looks nice. This looks nice. Hub upgrade one. Select ten rods. All right, so let's make ten rods. All right, and in you go. Hub upgrade one, storage and frame completed. Equipment like the portable miner can now be made in the workshop. Congratulations on completing your first milestone, the first of many providing access to new recipes and technologies for the fix it mission. Next objective, complete hub upgrade two. Well ahead of you, Ada. Okay. Hub upgrade Oops. two, power and shell completed. The smelter can turn raw ore such as copper and iron into ingots, and the biomass burner generates power when fueled. Fun fact, most of the native flora and fauna is compatible with Fixit technology. Fueling the biomass burner with inappropriate materials will result in deductions or even cancellation of your yearly bonus. Next objective, complete hub upgrade 3. This would do a workshop. We're going to slap down a couple of portable miners. I need um, enter to do list. Maybe I can get away with this quite quickly. Um, what do I need? So I need three rods, and two plates. That was enough to get me at least one, so that's kind of good. Right, let's go. Put that down here on one of these iron nodes. We can get that going. That'd be handy. Good. So let's put that in the hand. Pop that down there. And we'll just grab a bit by, by hand as well because we need that. Just want enough that we can make a few more belts and plates and stuff. We also need to go and get the copper, so let's do that as well. We'll get 30 here. Okay. Let's go and get the stuff off the copper nose here. We'll get our Xeno Zapper ready. So we can kill this bug thing here. Good. Get the stuff here. Samples of unknown alien species acquired. It is unclear where on the flora or fauna spectrum it lies, but initial data suggests <laughs> this might be a nest or an egg. Preserve the remains for later study. That we shall do, Ada. That we shall do. All right, bunch of copper. Go 
could turn that into some wire for us. So far, so good. Uh, it's got a few copper ingots. And let's check. That is recording. Looks good. Whoa. Gonna be exciting, huh? One point is finally here. So I'm planning on doing a uh, a few hours now, and then I might take the kids to school, and then do a few more hours after that during the day. So maybe I'll see you on stream later on, mate. Would be good, I think, huh? But you're all looking forward to it. It's been such a long time. Interested to hear what uh, Ada says as we go further on. We've got to get a smelt up and running as soon as we can. So we don't have to do this anymore. We drink some coffee while we're going along here. Ah. So what do we need? 20 plates. 20 rods. So we definitely need to set up a smelter thing very soon because this is already getting annoying. <laughs> okay, let's go and see what we've got over here. That looks like it's kind of full. Doesn't it? Does look like it's full. Okay, let's go. Let's take grab all of that. Can I build a smelter? I can. I need some rods. Okay, let's uh, let's do that then. Let's grab some rods. Uh, we'll make a bunch of rods. Need a little bit of cable. I oh, will do all the rods. We'll actually do all the rods. We'll get back to the plates in a minute. Cables go. I need a little bit of that. I'm going to put a smelter down here. Like that for the moment. We need to cable this here. From there to there. Uh, we need to tell you to do iron ingots. We'll put that in there. And let's grab a bit of uh, a little bit of wood actually. Be good. Let's run around, find some wood. Got this a little bit, a little bit just to get it going. That's all we want. Go, please. Good. Right. That's that. It'll make us some ingots. We can grab all of those. We'll smelt a few, uh, smelt a few by themselves as well. Right. Let's uh, bank this down. Some plates so we can get rid of that next uh, hub upgrade. And that should hopefully give us constructors and then we'll need a little bit of um, reinforced iron plates we can make a few constructors and then we'll be done and dusted the biomass burner the hub yeah okay we also need the independent biomass burner that would be good as well uh, i need 20 plates so this is something we've got to get up and running really quickly and we've got to worry about concrete as well good make me 20 plates please 20 plates, 20 rods, 20 wire. Yep, stop. Go. Boom, boom, and boom. Upgrade the hub. Hub upgrade free. Interior furnishing completed. The constructor can produce simple parts, and power poles allow for the expansion of the power grid. When you make the inevitable mistake, Fix its dismantling feature is designed to salvage all resources used during construction, in line with our zero waste policy. We understand that fix it pioneers are only human and thus prone to error. Next objective complete hub upgrade 4. Are we only human? Hmm, interesting. That's what, that's what I think. Uh, I need a few more rods to do this. Uh, rods, sorry, need some rods. Let's grab that. We get a couple of portable miners set up. We'll need a few to get the miners running. I don't think we have miners yet, do we? We'll see in a second. Yeah, probably a bit, probably too many portable miners. Uh, production, constructor, smelter, no power yet. Okay, let's grab. Of these, put them down over here, or two actually. 
go there. Oh, really? <laughs> oh, that's handy. Right, so over here we have. Uh, actually, what was? Where's the limestone? Uh, is there another one up this way? There might be a better one over here, actually. Yeah, that one's actually closer, so we'll take the closer one. Jump down here, and we'll zip this bad boy here. We will need concrete very shortly. Come here, buddy. Go. Look at this. Boom, boom, boom. Boom, boom, boom. Okay, that's two down there. Have one more, so we'll go and slip that on the other iron node. Do you want me to get rid of that? No, it doesn't go away if I do that. Okay. So we need actually need a bit of limestone for some power poles. No, let's slip this down here. Grab all of that. Put it in here. go Let's take that out can I build a constructor what do I need reinforced iron plates okay we made two reinforced iron plates uh, reinforced iron plate needs screws so I need a few more rods I need 24 of these if I remember correctly two of these uh, six I think right okay. There we go, two of these. We need a bunch of iron plates for the belt in between. That'll do. I need a uh, quick constructor down here. Nice. Oh, I don't have belts yet. <laughs> I don't have belts yet. Okay, fair enough. Um, you can make iron plates. Take uh, that, sorry in here making iron plates I need to make a power pole for that I need concrete okay let's grab some concrete okay it is done let's put down a up on power pole here let's get rid of this quickly this one here onto there, that to there. Oh, more cable required. Okay. Grab a little bit more cable. That'll do. Okay, so I'm guessing you're about to run out of wood. So let's grab some more. Oh. Potential edible collected. Reminder that look and smell alone do not provide sufficient data to determine exact risk of consumption. Just because it looks like you can eat it does not mean it won't eat you. Store this potential resource for later use. All right, so we get a bunch of wood from here. I want the wood. I want the wood. Can you give me the wood? Something like that. No. Okay. So we want to keep this going at the moment as long as we can. Right, let's pop that in the machine. Well, we have to try the toilet, I guess, as well. Right, then I'll keep that going for a little while. Is the toilet actually up and running? <gasps> Ooh! Ooh! Really can flush things down the toilet. <laughs> Oh, that's cool. I suppose we should check here. Ah, oh, okay, we can't really see much here yet because we're still in the process of doing... Ooh! Oh, that's very cool. <laughs> oh, I've got to take that one. Build gun. Oh, I like that. Trinket. Nice. Oh, cool. All right. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know you're there. Thank you. 
you can go away. Right, so we'll grab some plates out of here. Wooden plates, that's excellent. Um, you out of here, you go into here. Make me some more plates. Let's grab the iron from here and we'll slap that. We'll grab all of that. We'll grab all of that. In the machine. And we need another setup like this. Uh, I need some iron rods. Okay. I want to make uh, one of those or one of those. That'll tell me what I need. Probably rods, right? But you know, don't we have uh, ingots here? Let me grab some ingots out of here. That's only 11. Some ingots, and we'll turn those into plates, right? Yeah, plates I need. Not enough screws, we need some more rods. Okay, I need to make a few more ingots, sorry. I have to do a bit of manual labor. Some more rods, please. Screws, I have 12, I need 24. Stop that. I need reinforced iron plates, two of them. Okay, good. Let's get that done then. Uh, I need a smelter. Go here, and I need a constructor to go next to it. Go. You can do copper ingots, and you can do wire. Power up on here. Come on here. Put you onto that. Ah, no cable. All right, good up. Cable required. Oh, okay. Pretty far. Let's make a bit more copper. Some wire. Some cable. Might be enough, might not be enough. We'll see, I guess. Cable from here to here. There to here, there to here, and there to here. Okay, good. Clap the copper in here. Uh, it's iron ore. Uh, uh, let's grab some copper then. Grab that. All of that. Grab all of that. Slap it in here. What do I need? I need 75 plates. Okay, and put that in there, and get that going. This will take copper ingots in a few minutes. How much concrete do I have? 14 concrete. So I can actually sign off that. Do I have 75 plates? Let's check on that. I do have 75 plates. And I don't have enough cable, but we'll better do that in a second. So let's put that in, that in, and that in. I need 20 cable. So let's grab a bunch of wire, I guess. Yep, that's probably enough. We'll manually hack this. That's just not going to be enough, is it? No, it's going to be a bit short. <laughs> that's alright. No, oh, it's too short or something. Neat. Uh, do that, please. Okay, bank the cable out. Do cable in. All right. Grade four. Hub upgrade four. Landing platform and utilities completed. Conveyor belts connect the output of one building to the input of another and transport resources. Due to past incidents, I have been asked to issue a clarification. Portable miners, obviously, do not have a connection for conveyor belts. There is nothing to suggest, visually or functionally, that they can be connected to portable miners. If this is something you struggle with, do not worry. Fixit has alternative uses for all their pioneers. Next objective, complete hub upgrade 5. Indeed, hub upgrade 5 is... Uh, do, 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 do. what is it? Uh, 75 rods, 50 cable, and 20. That can I build a miner yet? Nope, nope, miners must still be coming. Okay, so we need to do a bit more concrete. So let's grab 
Can I make a craft bench? Uh, special? No, I can't. That way. We'll grab the. Uh, where is it? Am I going the right way? Oh, there it is. Yep, yep, yep. I am going the right way. We'll grab the uh, stuff from here. Take all of that. Take all of that. It's not going to give us too much. We need to get something set up down here shortly for this. We'll grab this wood while we're going past, though. To keep our Bunsen burner running. We don't have to worry about putting it. And we need to get upgrade to the next one as soon as we can as well. So we get a bit more power because we're going to run out shortly. We're going to have enough power to run everything we want. Anyway, wood. Oh, that was close to running up. Um, it was, I think, I'm making bang some concrete out. You know what? Let's do that. Do -do -do. 20 concrete, 50 cables, 75 rods. Okay. Grab a bunch of fine ingots so we can make rods pretty quick. Alright, let's do that. Should have a bunch of spear ingots here, hopefully. Yep. Hope we can scrap all of those. That's almost running out. We're gonna top that up so we don't stop. That all of that. Put in the machine here so it keeps going. We'll check our copper machine as well. Make sure that's still going. We'll put a bit of copper in here. Yep, it's still running, so it's kind of good. Pop that in you go. Then I grab that wire. It's not quite enough to make the copper we need, um, but I can do... Oh, I can almost do the rods. Let's bang those out. And we'll bang a bit of cable out. That, again, it's going to be a little bit short, but it's all right. Okay, we'll grab some more rods in a second. That's going well. It's going very well. Even better than our test the other day. 52. I am three rods short. Grab that. How about this? And uh, what do I want to make? Rods, 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 rods. Might as well make them all. Okay. Hub upgrade 5. Power expansion completed. The miner, unlike portable miners, can be connected to conveyor belts and requires power to function. Caution, as you expand, the energy demand of your production may exceed the capacity of your power grid. The onboarding program was established because Fixit pioneers often experience memory issues after planetfall. If you are experiencing nosebleeds, nausea, existentialism, or an itchy scalp, there is no need for concern. This should pass within five to seven work days. Next objective, complete hub upgrade six. Oh, I don't think there's anything wrong with my scalp at the moment. Um, oh, we're gonna have to do something here. That would seem to be a bit unfortunate. Uh, I need a bit of wire. Or a bit of cable. Okay, let's grab the wire or cable. Do -do. Uh, should have plenty of wire in here. Take that wire, I think this just ran out of copper, so let's go grab some copper and top that up. Or can I make another miner? I don't think I can, right? Oh, okay, let's make another miner thing. We'll get this running at least. Uh, grab all that, grab all that, put down a miner. Yeah, point this way, please. There we go, grab the belt. 
you straight into there. Jump. We'll make that look pretty in a little bit. Uh, I need. Yeah, 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 yeah. Kind of expecting that. Okay, we can make it to there. We need some more wiring cable. Yeah, we don't run out of fuel. That's all right. That's that's something different <laughs> to the other issues we might have. Um, let's make a bit of cable. It's probably enough. These two up here. Okay, and we need. Yeah, I think I've only got grass left, right? Did we actually blow it? No, we did blow it. Okay, there we go. So we should still hopefully be under the limit. I guess we'll see in a moment. Just okay. Oh, I'm not hook this one up though. Yeah. Okay. Well, that's, that's actually kind of fair enough, so let's get rid of this, get rid of that. Um, we'll hook this up to this, that up to this up to, ah, get rid of the, ah, no, okay, let's do that, sorry. That one goes to, to, to there, and this one goes to here. Or well, can I actually make biomass burners? I don't think so. No, not yet. That must be coming. Okay, so then we take uh, all of this out of here. We split it. Half goes in there, half goes in here. Turn it on. Turn it on. Okay, that'll be fine. Uh, although it is, of course, running on grass, which is not the best. Um, okay, 100 rods, 100 plates, 100 wire. We have some iron plates there. Is this running? Yeah, excellent. I've got a whole bunch of this though to go in there. And this other one is running as well, so it should be copper coming there in a second. If I've got copper, I'll throw it in here real quick. I do. A bunch of copper. Only 24 wires, not enough wire. That's fine though. Um, yeah, well, uh, a bunch of concrete. Okay. Uh, so, oh, I did it run it already. Oh, jeez, that was quick. Wow, okay. Uh, right, that's going to be annoying. So, let's, well, I guess we have to find some wood, right? Is the only solution to that. Wood burns much better than grass. So, let's go pick up a bunch of wood. And we're going to need the bio that's upgraded real quick. Wood, wood, wood. What should I have? 21, is that it? Oof, it's not very much. Some more over this way, I think. No, that looks like grass. Oh, there's a little bit here. Not as much as I was hoping though. A bit here. Right. Better than nothing, I guess. I said I wanted to come and pick up the limestone, so we might as well do that while we're here. Since we're roughly in the right place. Otherwise, we'll be done pretty soon, I think. Oh, lots of stuff in here. Hello, lizard doggo. I need 50 concrete, right? So this should work just fine. A bit more wood there, more wood there. How much wood have I got? 56. <laughs> Not enough by a long shot. But I guess it will have to do. We're going to have to push on pretty quick, though. <laughs> Multiple biomass burners can be connected to the same grid. They can indeed, but we don't want to do that. Today? All right. 
get us a little bit more stuff. Not enough though. Uh, we need to get to the next level and we need to get a few things uh, sorted out. I like the um, underclocking. We need underclocking. Uh, now I guess we can bang out a bunch of that stuff. Yeah, sorry, it might be a bit boring here for a second. Uh, we just got to get rid of it. There's no point we can't um, invest it into the machines anymore. So we might as well manually make some rods and plates so we can get out of this. I think upgrade six is the last one. Do I remember correctly? We have, um, how many plates do we have? 73, so we actually really only need 27. Okay, so we can make the plates. How many rods? We only have 14 rods. Theoretically, I suppose we should be making the rods now. Let's do that. Oh, you know what? This is annoying already. It's... Oh, there's only three there? Okay. How do I do that? Okay. Alright, we're going to have to do the rods. Manually, I really thought there'd be more ingots hanging out there. Alright, this is hopefully the last thing we have to do manually. After this, we'll be able to move on with our lives. I need 80 rods. Oh. Doo -doo -doo. Now the way so far so good. I need 50 concrete as well. So we get this knocked off and then I think we'll be back to uh, be able to what are we going to do next? Tamriel, yes it is mate, it is 1.0 so you got something interesting to do tonight then <laughs> time to start again yeah, are you going to? Oh, yes, no, are you? Oh, that's a shame. You want some help, mate? I know I know a uh, good outside contractor who's available at very reasonable rates. If you need any assistance with, uh, with C-sharp type stuff. And Windows, which I don't think you do really, do you? With a crack. Ah, well, that's a good idea. Take Friday off. We've got Friday off, then you might as well go and have a game. Have something to do. I'm quite looking forward to building the space elevator. Oh, what do I save already? 35 minutes coming up? Okay. At least the auto save will be quick. That was good. All right, so now we should be able. Oh no, I need to, I need a bit of wire. So let's go and grab the wire. We've got a few things set up. So man, we've got uh, just a, a um, smelter and a constructor making a few iron plates and a bit of wire. Two miners up and running, so it's enough to keep us going in the immediate future. So we grab this wire out of here. We need a few other things sorted out, but this will hopefully be this sorted. At least we'll see in a second. Grade 6, landing platform hydraulics completed. Crater landing initialized. Congratulations, you have completed onboarding and achieved the absolute minimum skill level required of a Fixit pioneer. Fixit looks forward to your future achievements because a future with Fixit is a future with you. Tier 1 and 2 milestones are now available in the hub, and biomass burners can now be built individually. Your first official objective is to initiate project assembly by building the space elevator. 
This objective will take a significant amount of resources, so Fixit recommends getting to work. All right. So looking at this, this all looks very much the same. Uh, yeah, yeah. Okay. I know. I know they're picking up. Don't worry about that. Uh, we're going to need pretty much immediately this is what we want 500 screws 100 cable 100 concrete and we get that we can get the biomass burners that's uh, only the biomass um whatchamacallit i don't know what i want to say uh this has a a consumption a capacity of 30 megawatts so we can get rid of this get rid of this put this onto here this onto here and these will get a bit more efficient production out of this we just throw all the grass in in there or the leaves sorry it'll burn quick or oh, cheese <laughs> very quickly that's not going to last very long but at least we'll get some more plates and stuff out of it yeah so we want to um get to biomass as quickly as we can so we have something decent going on here um 500 screws 100 cable so i can do 100 cable 62 cable which is not too bad i have a bunch of copying it so that's sorry man i said it was going to be the last manual smelting stuff oh doesn't it oh you need a php <laughs> oh god yeah you're doing proof of concepts the nasty stuff I feel sorry for you, mate. I feel sorry for you. Yeah, I'm. Uh, okay, I think last time I told you I finished my last job. Yeah, I'm throwing a few apps out, applications out for other jobs at the moment, but uh, a few of them are having exact, that exact issue. Um, uh, on site required, and it's usually usually in England, uh, which is a bit tricky for me, uh, being where I am. But uh, still putting a few a few things out there so we'll see we'll see yeah, yeah I know that only that's to be expected that it would run out like that we're only firing it on grass and grass burns real quick okay so it's at least got rid of all our copper ingots here it would be yeah but there's a, a few companies there's one and one i sent a a speculative application off to in in germany um a few days ago uh that might be interesting and uh one that's kind of it's almost it's kind of based in melbourne um which is you know clearly not where i am um but they do have some interesting projects which would be quite good i think so you know we'll see how that goes now otherwise i'll, I'll start applying for stuff here uh, in the next uh next weeks if, uh, if nothing comes up from overseas, although I clearly would like to stay uh, doing that and not have to go into an office here. But you know how these things work out. Sometimes they work, sometimes they don't. Okay, let's get rid of a bunch of ingots here. Yeah, it would. It would. But I'm not sure they're into mostly remote office. Now yeah, we'll see. We will see. I only did that yesterday, so a bit early to speculate on what could uh, what could happen there. So I need to get some more concrete. Okay, there's our cable. So I add that in there. The concrete in as well. Five hundred screws. That's a lot of screws, especially considering. Ugh, you are using them at the same rate as you are accepting them so that is a bit of an issue oh i really don't want to do this <laughs> here's some wood look we'll grab this wood put that in our burner that'll get it going for a little bit uh, oh more more wood here excellent more wood do okay, some more Okay. Fair enough. Probably not, but it's it's all good as going for the second. Do, 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 do. <laughs> you already want to get into it. Here we go. Burn that. 
make us some more. Actually, what do I need? What, what do I need? I actually need a bunch of that to make. Oh, oh I'm sorry. I'm gonna nick that. Gonna hand smelt that. Gonna make a bunch of rods. Gonna make a bunch of screws. Is it in the screw factory set up yet? Because I don't have enough power because I need the biomass. So we need the biomass thing first. Once we get that, we can um, put something decent into the... I do have biomass. I have biomass already. What am I doing? What are you doing, you fool? Wait, what? Oh my god. What an idiot. What an idiot. Give me that back. Give me that back. Yep, 100 biomass will last better than any of those. Excellent. Well, that's better. Okay. Oh, my bad. <laughs> uh, actually, sorry. Now I'm here. How are we doing on this? How much have we got a reserve? Not very much. Okay. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Let's keep going with this. Yeah, there was actually a bit of a, um, a boo-boo in the update. Uh, Steam didn't update properly. Um, they need to change the name of the factory game. Anyway, we've, we fixed it and got everything running. Oh my lord. 500 screws. Oh, I hate screws. Um, you know what we're going to do? Can I make another one of these? I can indeed. Boom. I make another one of these. Probably not. I need two reinforced iron, reinforced iron plates and uh, two cables. Um, I need two of those. So let's grab that quickly. Uh, reinforced iron plates. I need four of them. Yeah, exactly. Oh, no, I need some more iron plates, I guess. There we go. No. Oh, there we go. We're going to start with this. Reinforce iron plates. And we'll just set up a quick um, pipe rod and uh, screw setup. Just so I don't have to do this manual. Oh, cable, 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 cable. Do that. Take all of that. All right. We'll get there in the end, mate. We'll get there in the end. Uh, uh, something like that. That's probably enough. Up here. And one over here. Uh, something like that. I don't know. Doesn't matter. It's here. That goes here. You, sir, will make iron ingots. You, sir, will make rods. And you will make screws. Yeah. I we need one of these. Uh, oh, I need concrete. Oh, damn it. Concrete's so far away. Can I make a... Well, I can. Excellent. So we'll go down here, we'll make a craft bench, and... Grab some concrete. This will be the next thing on the list, though. Set up a bunch of concrete. So, come here. Grab all of that. Didn't grab it. Grab all of that. Grab all of that. Let's go. Uh, concrete. Which do we need? Oh, we actually need quite a bit. And I need it for making the. Oh, I need it for making the power poles as well. Ay, ay, ay. Well, let's do that. Do, 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 do. Ah, do, do, do. Any more? We've got any more? I think I will do it twice. It's going to give us a little bit more concrete. It's going to give us. Uh, yeah, it'll give us enough. Okay, excellent. So, one thing we need to do quite quickly. 
is get these things set up when we're getting properly into our power system. Uh, let's grab so much of this as we can make the biomass, then we might as well grab all the stuff around here that we can. So we don't have to back about too much. And interesting, can I make... Um, Okay, and storage containers I can do as well. Excellent. Well, that's kind of good. We'll do that immediately. Set that up. Um, you need to go from here to here. To here. To here. This one can come here. Now we need one of these. Uh, where is it? Here. Go here. Go here. This one comes over to here, does it make it? it does, excellent. Now from here to... Yep. And then we need to do a slight rearrangement over here. So let's see if I can do this. Can I build a second one? I can indeed. So we're just going to build them off here for a second now. Um, actually, I was thinking about that can't set it up with the belts yet because we need um we need the splitters we don't have the splitter set up yet we'll grab that in a second well hopefully anyway um this should have a little bit of wood left in it no 63 okay good so we can hook this up yep yeah. uh with the biomass that gives us a bit more range and then we can hook this here up to here I hope that one no not to that one not to that one no to one of them this one really oh, it's a piss poor design running looks like it excellent good right so then we'll have some iron ore and we'll have some of that and we'll have some of that and in the meantime, we'll grab these plates. 140 plates, nice. Um, okay, we're going to grab that again. We're going to smelt these last screws. Why do I not have enough concrete? I do have enough concrete. We can put the concrete in. And then we just need the um, iron rods. So we'll get that done. I just realized I turned the music off ages ago. Put it back on again, right? Hope you can hear it. Actually, um, I, mean, I didn't think I could just do this, right? Make me some screws like that will be quicker than doing it like this. Yep, well, it'll be quick enough. I can keep going with this though. So. Well guys, ads are coming up uh, if you're following me on Twitch. Um, so what we'll do is we'll just go to a small uh, commercial break. I'll take a little break and have a drink and stand up and whatnot and uh, I'll just smoke the rest of the stuff while you're, um, you're watching what's going on. So go to the intermission screen and um, see you back in uh, five minutes. Yeah, well, okay. No. Cool. 